All right, man. Um, my my small car got towed today. My box car, my XB, my workhorse, the one that got all my work shit in it and everything. So I'm about to fire up the Hellcat, and I'm about to go up here. And I'm really pissed off. So I'm like, I'm so mad because my car been parked in front of this. Like I always park it right here in front of this car, man. Like every night to so this shit don't get stolen or nothing happens to it. But these tow truck people, they ain't been towing cars maybe in like a goddamn year. So fucking they just came back just un like no warning like they didn't put a warning on a no no paper on the thing saying hey we're gonna start towing again or anything they just came back no warning took my car although it wasn't parked like it's only blocking like i'm all the way parked at the end and it's like to me you come to like the poorest area you know what i mean out here in this city and like look i'm in a little ass neighborhood and you take my car and it's not even just that okay then you want to charge almost four hundred dollars for one day to get my car back? You a bitch. All right, I'm a little broke, so I'm finna go up here and I'm finna see what they talking about. I need my car, obviously, so whatever it is, I'm gonna have to pay it. But man, bro. <laughs> Y'all don't know, man. Maybe you know the way I'm feeling, but I'm like, like turned up right now, man. Like, I feel like I need a drink and to calm down because I'm going to have to go off in that gym a little bit later, man. I, I, I really hate tow truck people, dude. Like, really. Like, the ones that just come and do shit like that and charge so much. Like, like okay, if you come in to pick up a car and you're going to tow it, at least only charge like $100. You know what I'm saying? 150 you want to charge almost $400 to pick up somebody's shit from where they live? Like, <sighs> all right, man, here we go, man. Just pulled up. Like I said, I'm not feeling myself. What's going on? I can't see shit. Uh, what's up? I'm trying to pick up my um, car. What car is that? It's a Scion. Say that again. Let me see. I mean, it's a Scion. It's a it's an XB. It's the silver one. They said it was the only one up here. Dude came and picked it up today. With no warning, no nothing though. In the middle of a pandemic. And then talking about some three hundred dollars. Like, what kind of shit is that, man? Come to a poor ass neighborhood and charge 300 bucks. 400 actually, was it like three something? It's in the car. Are you the registrar owner? Yes. Okay, can you I'm trying to stop, like man, come on man. Like this dude come fucking tow my shit, man. I just want to pick up the car so I can get up out of here because I'm fired up. Yeah, this is the fucking raggedy. This, this tow place right here, this, this tow place already got uh charges on them already. Because they've been no, doing illegal shit. Oh, it don't matter because I can do whatever I want. Okay, then, this is my camera. To help you out, then. Well, I, get somebody else who's going to help me out. It don't matter. Because I'll call the police up here. Go ahead, call the police. Give me my stuff. You're like, you can't keep my car. Okay, I don't care. You can't keep my car. You can't keep my car. It doesn't matter. You can't keep my car. You But you cannot keep my car. That's all it is to it. You cannot keep my car. It's my car. Okay, I'll go ahead and call the police department. That's not a problem. It's my car. Like, how you gonna sit here and tell me you yeah, you finna no, keep my car? Yeah, Alright, my guys, man. I'll see y'all in a minute because she don't want to give me my car. Man, $300, man. Pandemic. $300, man. <sighs> Look, dude, I usually don't, I'm, I'm usually not this way, but I woke up on the wrong side of the bed today, man, and I had a couple of, like, it's stuff. But let me get my, let me get my box car, my little soldier, and get up out of here. All right, man, so, Hellcat. <laughs> um, box car, 
So I got it back. It almost been like $400 for them to come pick my shit up from where I live. No warning, no nothing. Hey, we're back towing again. Fuck the pandemic. We're coming to get your shit. Uh, maybe you might want to move it since we got some type of fucking, like, no courtesy at all. You know what I mean? Because you, before we had, like, a different tow company, and before they, like, if they wasn't towing, or even before they tow your car, they, they put a note on it, like, hey, look, you got to move your car. And plus, my car, look, 100%, bro, it was not parked in a fire lane, nothing like that, man. What it was, it was just parked in front of my car. And now I'm trying to think, like, do they consider that, like, a fire hazard or something? But it wasn't a fire lane, it wasn't nothing, maybe it's double parked, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Y'all tell me, man, is that double parked or what? I know it kind of pissed me off. I had some pork chops, man. Your boy want to eat again. I got to find a way to get both cars home because I was so pissed off. I just flew up here. You know what I mean? I had to use my credit card once again because I don't like using my credit card. <sighs> but I had no choice. I mean, because the money I got right now that I'm saving, that I'm trying to come up, like, like, okay, I spent a lot of money like these last few months, like four months bro and then getting the car getting the hellcat like it cost so much that i had to put something down in order to leave with it which i was prepared for but when extra shit start biting me in the ass i'm still prepared to handle it because i got like three four credit cards to handle anything extra that come in i knew like in my head like if anything extra was to happen these, these are my way out. You know what I mean? Like, I'll, I'll just push come to shove. I'm going to use my credit card because I know I'm going to pay it off. And it's only going to make my credit better. That's how I feel about it. But your boy just feels like I was kind of raped a little bit. Bye, baby. <laughs> it's back there. <laughs> I'm coming back to get it, though. So no worries. I think I calmed down a little bit. The money is spent. Can't cry over spilled milk, but I'm still going to call him and talk crap. Um, I just feel, it just feels sucky, man. I have to spend extra money on something that just really shouldn't have been spent on. I felt like they could have came with a warning, let me know. I would have just moved the car. I mean, it's right in front of my apartment. It says the number right above, too. Like, it says the apartment number. He could have came. Hey, man, look. I'm going to have to tow the car. This is our first day back after the whole pandemic. I know it's been a year, but I'm going to have to start towing again. So, you know, I'm just giving you a chance. Maybe you want to move your car. You know what I mean? It's not in a fire lane. It's not really blocking anything. It's just parked in front of my car, in front of my carport. That was it. But the nigga, that's just me, man. Maybe I'm just too cour courteous for this planet. My baby though all right man if y'all don't know my sister by now yo yo hey y'all <laughs> all right man she in a nice little Volkswagen right now though Ooh. yeah all right man so she came to help me out real quick she got to get one of the cars we got to take them back to the house then we got to go back and get whatever else car that we left there and redo that so <sighs> Haters. Hey, hey, I gotta do some talking, cuz, nigga, cuz I don't wanna get copyrighted, nigga. <laughs> All right, man, we uh, in this bit. Going to pick up my baby. Man, I mean, I just think it's cold how they come into people's apartments, pick up their shit, no warning, and charge three. Almost four hundred, yeah, almost four hundred dollars. Four hundred dollars. There should be a law against that shit, but it's not. One of them buttons. All right, man. So I'm back over here to pick up the box car. Legendary box car got me through a whole bunch. I wasn't gonna let them keep my shit. That's for sure. I bet you that's what they was planning on, like, oh, this poor ass. Because they thought, like, maybe this car belonged to somebody who can't afford to get it back. 
Maybe we can keep it for two, three days. Maybe we could charge even more. I know how y'all think. I got a tow truck. I got a, I got a person that owns a tow truck company in my family. So I know how y'all think. Yeah. I'm telling you. That agency, this this little tow truck agency, super losers. They got they got fucking um what is it? They got lawsuits and everything going against them right now because they be doing janky stuff, just rolling into anywhere, picking up people's shit and trying to tow it, charging, trying to charge out the ass, man. It's just it's just disgusting to be honest. And and our San Bernardino PD uses them too, so Woo But <laughs> my baby though <laughs> hop up in this thing man hop up in this thing let me see oh uh, uh, yeah it feels good yeah i even got a water in the door mm -hmm. turn on the light up in here man i even got a little water in the door you know yeah this is the work car man yeah you got the paperwork's right here for these tr for this trash ass tow company um got me some chap stick for the lips what else we got up up in here man all my work stuff in the back look let's see there he is right there the suitcase all that like man, you are not finna keep my car man but either way it go man lucky i'm blessed to be in a position i am in order to even get my car back as fast as i did uh, no matter what devil out here trying to make you know make things harder and even with you guys man just stay blessed uh stay focused if anything is going hard just remember it ain't the end of the world uh it's only the end if you make it the end so just got to keep pushing brother um i think it's time to eat again and hit the gym oh y'all didn't know this was a stick huh let me see where i put the key oh yeah I, ain't it ain't push button like I'll be forgetting. Yeah. Hey, I should make the box car burn rubber in front of a little establishment. <laughs> oh. Nah, no, I'd be too many police over here, man. Too many cops. Man, I hate shit that make my day feel longer. So, I parked out front before. Look at, like, this is where I live, man. Like, real talk, this is where I live. This is where I'm at. And I parked my car out here before. And twice, actually. No, 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 no. Once. It was once here and somewhere else. But... Here, they, man, I parked it out front. First time I ever parked it out front. They bust the window, got in it for some workout stuff. Like, like a little small bag, some pre-workout, and some wrist straps. Bust the window for that, and stole, stole that little shit out. So it had to have been like some, some type of teenage kid or something. But it's just fucking sucky that the kids around here are even that way. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hey, boo. Hey, boo. What's up? Can I holla at you or what? Over there looking thick. I mean, can I get the number or what? What's good? You gonna shoot it? Uh, playing hard to get, huh? All right. Gas, 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 always gas. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I get mad because, <laughs> to be honest, like, yeah, I own a business, I do my thing, but I'm not rich, I ain't got a bunch of money, and I definitely don't have $400 to be giving away to somebody for no reason, so that's why I got pissed. It's, you know, no, it's, it is what it is. Like, I, you just don't want to give money away 
for no reason. And then, like, my business ain't booming. Like, I'm not making a lot of money. I'm making enough to pay bills right now. So, I, like, I really didn't want to give that away. Even though I use my credit card because I know I could pay it back, like, you know what I mean, and payments and stuff like that because I wasn't just going to dump $400 of cash from my pocket to some raggedy-ass tow company. But, you know, it kind of is what it is, but my baby, though. <laughs> and if you're new to the video, man, black satin, black satin up here. We got the sunroof, black satin on the back. Ah, wide body. Yeah. My baby, I'm the man. my baby I got a thick, ain't she? With the bourbon in my hand that I'm making change of stance. I'm, I'm like, all right, man. In advance, and I rarely have a chance. Rather I guess it's time the to go take some frustration out on these plates, man. I'm like, I'm just saying, in the land, guess I'm back in high demand. In my car in from Japan, but I drive it like I ran from the cops. I'm like, damn, see you tweaking on the gram. I can never understand how you claim to be a man, cause you're not. I'm like, cause you less able. Get these squares stretched out, that's a rectangle. Tell that girl to wipe me down like a wet table and come and get your ass beat. That's a vegetable. Rest in peace. Take this shit off my head. Man, I need to hurry up and get that muffler delete because that's just not loud enough, man. <laughs> I'm going to get it soon. Maybe in like the next two weeks. Get this windows tinted. You know, get the decals on the wheels. Yeah, have him lit up a little bit. I do want my money back from that tow truck place, but... I was thinking like, can you like just call your credit card company and tell them to cancel that payment? Even after you already... <laughs> I feel like you can. I'm going to give it a shot anyway because I'm janky like that. Shit, I'm petty. Fuck them niggas. <laughs> Hellcat. All right, my guys, man. I'm about to get in this. Take my ass home. Always, man. Blessing and stuff like that. At the same time, shit happens. We're human. We're allowed to get mad at things, I feel like. But as long as you get back to your normal state, don't let things ruin you. At least, at, at least the whole day. You know what I mean? And wake up the next morning and get to it.